What's going on guys, Eddie of Fliptronics. I'm gonna be going over three of the best crypto apps for beginners to be using in 2021 and beyond. Okay, so the three I'm gonna be going over here, not really in any specific order, but I gotta start things off here with Coinbase. Now, you know, I've been in the crypto space for like seven years. I've been using Coinbase for close to that same amount of time. It's been like six or seven years, but you know, uh, you can trade over 40 different cryptocurrencies currently on here. It's got a very user-friendly app, whether you're on iOS or Android, Android and um, you know it's just easy to trade on there plus they've got over 40 million members currently so a lot of built-in trust then of course we've got eToro crypto you know I've been a member here for I think like four or five months but I've got a little bit of money in my account, right around 1200 bucks. I do plan on adding more, but the cool thing about eToro Crypto is that it's a social trading app where you can like talk to people, make friends with people. And it's uh, got 15 different coins. So not as many coins, but you know, still a really good app to be using for sure. And then of course, Robinhood, I'm gonna throw on this list because you know, if you're already using a Robinhood stock trading account, there are a couple crypto coins I would consider buying on here. Of course, there are no fees associated with Robinhood, and it probably would be my last choice, obviously, on this list, but I do want to put it on here anyways. Um, also, as I'm going over these, if you guys want to get started on any one of them, I'll have some bonus sign-up and resource links in both the description and comments of this video. Okay, so now we're going to be taking a look closer look at Coinbase, and then I'm also going to give you some coin recommendations to get started with. Not going to be financial advice, but you know, here we go. Okay, so this year I actually went over 100,000 on my account. Now I've taken a little bit of money out since then. Right now I've got, you know, close to 40,000 in. And, uh, you know, I'm just trying to figure out what I want to do. But I definitely had a good year crypto wise, uh, you know, ton of profit, <clears throat> which is great, right? That's the whole point of this. But, um, you know, getting into crypto, there are a lot of different coins right now. So it is a little bit confusing. Now I do want to pull up some of the things you can do here on Coinbase. So I've got Ethereum pulled up, second most popular coin by market cap. But you can pull up different price histories. There's a news feed. You can set up recurring deposits. Um, you know, so a lot of cool features within here. They also have price alerts, but yeah, I mean, this is just kind of like the basic outlook of it. And then, of course, on eToro Crypto, uh, you know, 15 different coins, like I said. I own a couple different ones on here right now. I've got Tron and XRP. Uh, those are the two I own. But, you know, 15 different coins. When you click on them, like I said, they've got these built-in communities where you can, like, chat with people, uh, you know, about different updates for coins. They've got, you know, you can make friends with people. You can, like, post. A lot of cool things you can do on here. And you can't do this kind of stuff on any other crypto app out there. So eToro is very unique in that aspect. And uh, yeah, I mean, I've definitely enjoyed signing up here. And the other cool thing too is they've got one of the best bonuses for getting started, um, which you can take advantage. Um, it's a $50 uh, sign up bonus and you know it's definitely worth checking out for sure. I'll have that link, like I said, in the uh, description and comments of this video. Then of course, we've got Robinhood pulled up. I've had a good year on Robinhood uh, for trading stocks, right? I have bought and sold some crypto on here. The problem with Robinhood is that they don't have a lot of coin offerings and you don't exactly own the coins, so you can't like send money to people if you buy like bitcoin for example but you know uh they have a uh, dogecoin i really like uh, dogecoin and ethereum would probably be the only two coins i would recommend looking into uh at this point based on price points and just kind of what i think uh but yeah i mean dogecoin is actually based on a japanese dog i think it's the shibu inu it's pretty hilarious but yeah so let's go over the coins i would recommend getting started with here guys uh, of course on coinbase you know i got to go with ethereum now bitcoin has broken its all-time highs it's going to continue to do that i'm sure uh you know in the rest of 2021 and uh beyond ethereum it's all time I was around 1400 bucks. You know, we could easily see, you know, that price get crushed, uh, you know, over the next year or so and, you know, go to between three and 5,000. I, I could definitely see it for Ethereum. So, I mean, getting in even at 700 bucks would be good right now if you're willing to hold on to that for, you know, the long term. Then, of course, uh, the graph GRT, this coin came out recently. They're comparing this coin to Google because it like indexes uh, different uh, blockchains. So, it's like a, I get they're trying to compare it to it being like a search engine but anyways i like it it just came out it's got a low price point if you get in the 30 40 cent range it's a good buy right now then uh, of course tron trx this coin's been around since 2017 i own some of it it's a top 20 crypto coin i would definitely recommend looking into it then xrp a lot of bad things going on right now in the news for xrp but it's still a top three crypto coin the price on it is just right right now 
uh, under 30 cents, you know, it could pop off really big um, at some point. So keep an eye on this one for sure. Then, of course, like I said, uh, you know, over on Robinhood, Dogecoin, man. I would definitely recommend grabbing some Dogecoin on here. Why not? Other than that, Ethereum would also be a good buy because they have that on Robinhood. Uh, and that would probably be it, guys. But yeah, I mean, getting started in crypto on any of these uh, apps, exchanges, definitely recommend it. You know, the longer you wait, the more opportunities you're going to miss for sure. And uh, that's what it is. Uh, also, if you guys, like I said, could smash a like button on this video, subscribe if you haven't. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.